Heading due east on the 60 freeway just outside of Riverside, 20-year Marine Corps veteran Craig Gunny Donor safely strapped to his seat the burial flag of fellow Marine Michael Garris. The flag is en route to Garris's daughter in Florida. And I am now going to transmit that flag from person to person until it is personally delivered to her with an unbroken thread of love from here to her as opposed to putting it into some uh, FedEx or mailbox or something of this nature. Garris was found dead by the side of the 15 freeway near Mira Loma on July 1st. First thought to be a transient, Garris was discovered to be a fellow Marine. Last month, Garris received a military burial here at the Riverside National Cemetery, but his daughter could not afford to attend. I'm sure it will mean a lot to him to know that people loved him enough to take it directly to his daughter. After touching the flag to the temporary headstone, the mission was underway. California riders will be met just past Blythe by their Arizona counterparts, who will then escort the flag to New Mexico, Texas, Louisiana, Mississippi, and into Florida. To carry him all the way back and present his flag to his daughter is a significant honor. And a second burial flag will leave here tomorrow and be taken to Garris' mother in New Mexico by Bridget Madison, who lost her son in Iraq. I can't put into words that moment when you receive that flag is something you never forget.